Welcome to Always Analog, where we celebrate the beauty of analog technology in the digital world. Today, a look at a pencil, um, or a couple of pencils in this case. Uh, this is the Nataraj Marble HB pencil. And we have looked at Nataraj pencils here before, and uh, we like them overall and they are made in India by the Hindustan Pencil Company. But these marble pencils, what is so interesting to me about them is that no two look alike. That the painting process is such that um, each pencil is sort of unique. And I think that's really cool that we can have um, it is they are both the same under the skin, but that each one can sort of have this unique design. And I just love, you know, it, it harkens back to the, the tie-dye and wild kaleidoscopic kind of patterns of the 60s. And um, I just think these are really neat. And uh, I think they're pretty. And so... Um, I wanted to try them and see how they write as pencils um, because as my mama said, looks aren't everything, but, <laughs> but um, it is, uh, it is, these are just really cool and fun pencils. Uh, so uh, let's take a look here a little closer look at them. First of all, uh, they are a hexagonal pencil. And you can see there that they are. And uh, in both, I only have these two. Uh, both of these, the core is uh, fairly centered. Not a cedar wood pencil, okay, but a wooden pencil for sure. And if we look close, we can see, uh, you can see the design. And you can see Nataraj Marble HB made in India. And then the pencil has a white tip to it, um, which kind of works with any of the patterns that the pencil might come in. So different patterns, different color combinations, um, but, you know, just like I said, no, no two the same. Like, like people, like snowflakes, each one is unique. Um, you'll also see that these are probably often sold individually because each pencil has a um, barcode uh, and item number imprinted on the side opposite of the Nataraj printing, which is in black. So this is the Nataraj marble. Like I said, it is a hexagonal wood pencil. Uh, it is graded HB, um, and which is interesting because a lot of the Nataraj pencils, the 621 comes to mind, are like bold, extra bold, um, but they don't necessarily give a grading. But here we see one, HB. So we're going to uh, sharpen this up and do some writing with it. Okay, we have our Nataraj marble sharpened up and fairly smooth pencil, uh, very much in, in the Nataraj tradition. It is noticeably, however, not as soft as many of the other Nataraj pencils that we've used. So compared to the 621, as an example, this pencil is firmer.
but it is also soft for an HB grade. It does have a nice line. Uh, it is not ultra bold, I would say, but it is fairly dark. Um, and it is a quiet pencil. Mm-hmm. Let's put a little bit down. Now, since this pencil does not come with an attached eraser. Uh, I'm going to try a variety of block erasers and I'm going to start with my Nataraj dust clear eraser and see how it does on the Nataraj pencil. It does okay, I would say. Uh, I might even say it does a good job. Let's try a Pentel. Mm -hmm. We'll try a Mars. Nice. Uh, pink Carnation. Okay, art gum. Uh huh. Mini softy. Uh, what else do we have? Milan. Hartmuth Natural Rubber. Okay. Well, you can see, I think we've got a little shadowing on some, but, but the, uh, I have to tell you the vinyl erasers particularly did a very nice job on this. Um, so I'm going to give it erasability an A minus B plus. Something I was remiss in doing before I started erasing. So I just wanted to see mm -hmm how we smudged through on this and if there was a bit of a smudge drag, which I thought there might be. I don't think it is severe as some of the other Nataraj pencils, particularly those in what I would refer to as the bold line, but it is definitely there. Um, let me zoom out and we will do some more writing with the Nataraj marble.
Well, it is a nice writing pencil. Uh, and I would say uh, of the Nataraj pencils I've used, point retention is pretty good. Yes. So, there it is. Um, a nice pencil and cool looking pencil. Uh, so, you know, if, if you... Uh, if you like a pencil that's a little bit of a wild child that has uh, a kind of a fun uh, skin on it, uh, then perhaps this is a nice option for you. Uh, it is not, again, the traditional Nataraj, real dark, real bold, um, but it is fairly smooth and it writes nicely and comfortably. And so uh, it's a very erasable pencil. And I think people probably buy these more for their looks than for anything else, but it's certainly a good writing instrument. So thank you for being a part of this one. If you like what I do here, please subscribe, like, and share. I look forward to seeing you again soon right here on Always Analog.